Hey guys, in this video, we have some work from home jobs that you can get right now, part time, where you can actually get paid to literally just pay attention to ads. You're going to be watching ads, reading ads, and basically just giving some feedback on them. You're going to make sure these ads are actually working properly. And there's a few different places where you can find these. One, as you can see, is appin.com. This is a place that has all sorts of AI training type of jobs and they have something called a search ads evaluator where basically you can get paid to use your smartphone gmail address and you'll have to pass a qualification exam but there's no interview required you only have to work around 10 hours per week you have a few level checks that you have to do basically to make sure you do a good job but you basically get paid to rate tasks in the language in the locale you live in which usually goes by country and basically you get paid to be a search ads evaluator. So this is something you can do here at Appen. They also have many other types of jobs where you can find all sorts of different gigs where you do like speech collection, record videos, and many other things where you're basically helping train AI and stuff like that. You may see like a social media evaluator and a few others as well where you're essentially getting paid to help improve social media quality and so with these types of jobs at Appin, for instance, if you go to the pay section here and you look at their hourly pay, you can look and find anything related to ads quality. You see right here, it looks like they average, according to 43 people, around $24 per hour. So if you're okay with looking at search engines and making sure that the ads you know that pop up at the top and bottom of search results are relevant to what the search is, this is what you would be doing. And if you're wondering what it's like to work at Appin, they have 3.5 out of 5 stars, 67% would recommend working here to a friend. So the ratings are pretty solid as well. Another company that I've mentioned many times in the past that has these jobs is uh, TELUS International. They have an AI community section. They have lots of different jobs. I've covered many different ones here. One of the ones you can do is an ads evaluator. You can do this in the US, but they have these in other parts of the world as well. Like you see personalized internet ads assessor, Czech speakers in Austria, for instance, just as a, a random example. But I'm gonna use the US one as an example. But if you go here and type in ads, you can find that if you click search, you'll find lots of different countries usually have these available. So you see, you know, Armenia, you have Colombia, you have you know, Peru, Spain, Philippines, all sorts of different areas of the world where you can find these. So, so if you look at say the personalized ads evaluator or the internet ads evaluator, you are going to need to be the type of person that has good communication skills and use the internet on a daily basis. And payment will be based on completion of the agreed upon tasks or engagements within the specified time period. So you work your own hours, work from home, of course, they want you, in terms of qualifications, to reside in the country that you're doing this job for. So again, if you're applying in Armenia, you would need to make sure that you currently reside there. You must have familiarity with the current and historical business, media, sport, news, social media, and cultural affairs in your country. Suitable candidate must have full professional proficiency in English language, experience in use of web browsers to navigate and interact with a variety of content, access to and use of an Android or iOS smartphone to complete tasks. Also, a barcode scanner application must be installed on your smartphone to complete certain tasks. And also, active daily user of Gmail and other forms of social media. So, as far as what you're doing exactly, the actual description of the job is right here down below you will be reviewing online advertisements in order to improve their content quality and layout. You will be required to provide feedback and analysis on ads found in search engine results and provide ratings on their relevance to the search terms used. So you're literally using a search engine like Google and then making sure that the ads are quality, they're related, they have a good layout, they're not in a weird spot on the page, things like that, they're relevant that's the kind of thing you're going to be doing with these types of jobs. And again, they have a lot of these available at TELUS International. And then if you look at how much an, how much an ads quality rater typically pays on an hourly basis, you're looking at around $22 per hour on average. 
And then if you look at reviews here, you're looking at about 3.6 out of 5 stars and 68% of workers at TELUS International recommend working here to a friend. Now, another website where you can find these jobs uh, pretty often, especially in the last few months, is the Ads Quality Rater at we localize. So WeLocalize.com would be the website. They have lots of different ads quality rater positions right now. Now these are going to vary. These aren't. They're not always adding this many people. So if you are interested in doing this, you want to probably apply whenever you get the chance because you know there's a good chance they could take down a lot of these listings at any time once they have filled enough in each country. But you see lots of different countries on here, and I'm going to obviously use the U.S. one just as the example. And then for this one, they want someone who's pretty good with search engines. You know, you need to be a fluent speaker in whatever language you're applying in. And you will use a unique web-based tool to search, to evaluate search engine ads based on project guidelines. In this opportunity, you will receive prof professional development, work on exciting projects that will empower you to keep learning and growing. So essentially, you could also work across a variety of documents and content types. But hours, minimum five hours per week, up to 25 hours per week, set your own schedule. And then you're wanting to start ASAP, of course. This one, you could be a W-2 part-time employee, which may not be the case in all countries, of course. Uh, it may be more like an independent contractor in some places. And then when it comes to the requirements here, you have a fluency in English or whatever language you're applying in, strong understanding of your country's popular culture, you need to be at least 18 years of age or older. That could also vary depending on your country because different countries have different age restrictions. Web savvy and able to work in a fast paced environment. Excellent online research skills. Um, as far as your equipment, just a reliable computer and internet connection, reliable antivirus software. And you'll also have to sign a non disclosure agreement as well. And then benefits. You can also possibly get benefits here. I don't think I would, you know, count on this. They do mention it for this US version of the job, but again, being a part-time position or possibly a contractor position in other countries, you may not want to just completely depend on that. Now, if you look at an ads quality rater, you know, in other countries, let's say I just picked France just as an example. You know, this one they tell you is $13 per hour. They don't tell you that up front on the US one, but you know, you don't see anything about benefits on this one and you know you see that you are a freelancer in this country so there's a few things that will vary um, they do still want you to be fluent in english for this one and also in french so some of these you may need to be multilingual um, depending on the job but as far as how much these could pay you could make you know for instance some of these they'll tell you that if you go to apply for this job they may tell you sometimes on this page if you are like at least an estimate of like would you be okay making this much? Like here you go, $15 an hour in the US. Well, if you look at estimates on their glass door page and you look for anything related to like ad review or ad quality, you know, you see ad reviewer at 23 an hour here. If you scroll down some more, you may find something else like, you know, quality rater is pretty much the same thing as well. But an ad reviewer is probably the closest we have on this main page here. But you know that could vary. It could vary by the country. It could vary depending on you know which time you actually apply for these. Like you know maybe in the past they paid differently for the U.S. version than they do these days. It it just depends on a lot of things. But if you look at seven people who gave an average, their average was 23. But if you look at the full range, it's up to 29. And then if you look at what they said on this particular listing, it's 15. So. It's, it could be probably anywhere from around you know 10 to looks like $29 an hour if you really did the full range for these. But hopefully this was helpful. Don't forget to subscribe and click the notification bell if you want more daily work from home opportunities like these. Let me know what you thought about this video. Uh, click the like button if you thought this was helpful and you'd like to see more of these types of opportunities in the future. Maybe part time, maybe no interview or um, ads or search review type jobs where they're very easy and don't forget to leave a comment if you have a question for me or want to suggest something i cover in the future and i'll see you in the next video